Welcome to episode 1869. David Edelman, real estate billionaire from Philadelphia. Nine lessons. This is an outline of episode 1869. Lesson one to five. It's lesson six to nine. Lesson one, he invested in real estate when he was 13. His seed money of $2,000 he invested in Bob Mishna into Campus Apartment, founded by his uncle, Alan Horvitz. As in two, his mentor was his uncle. He was 10, his parents divorced, and his uncle, Alan Horvitz, became his best friend and mentor. As in three, at age 27, he was a young and precocious CEO. Lesson four, never use government money. Block by block in University City, when you see those sidewalks and brick walls out there, that's not the city of Philadelphia doing that. We did that. No, I didn't ask for help. The streetscape lighting, the new sidewalks, the brick walls, all things that people rely on city services for, I did it privately. Lesson five, he prefers to negotiate with smart people. Favorite counterparty. You know, I, I actually used to think that a dumb counterparty is great. I'm going to kind of pull the wool over their eyes and I'll be able to get what I want. And what, what happens is you grow frustrated. I'll take a sophisticated seller anytime. Lesson six, all business must adapt. We're not modeling population growth. Well, you know, Kelly, there's over 5,000 colleges and universities out there, and it's like any business, they need to adapt. And I can tell you this, in five years, 10 years from now, there's not going to be 5,000 colleges and universities out there. There, are just some that aren't the value proposition for mom and dad who are paying the bill. It's just not there. And so where Campus Apartments focuses at kind of the top 100, 150 schools, we're not. Since seven is private equity business since 2007. Company is called FS Investment. It has twenty-four billion dollars of asset under management. So an eight, he ventured into sports. Into sports, the last two years, reportedly bought the minority stick of NBA team 76ers, NHL team, New Jersey Devils. As a nine, he's trying to build a 1.3 billion arena of the 76ers. It's privately funded. We're not going to take any city money. You know, coming out of COVID, the city needs dollars to you know help people in need and help our schools and help everything else that's you know, going on. Do this. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.